The Patrick uh, Brisbane Auto Strad Terminal is very important to this company as it showcases the automated technology that we've developed uh, in Australia and it's our principal source of competitive advantage in an increasingly um, competitive market. Patrick pioneered automation in this country. Indeed, when the Brisbane Autostrad Terminal was first opened in 2005, it was only one of only three automated terminals in the world. We've used Kalmar machinery in a manual sense for many, many years. Kalmar were the leading manufacturer of straddle carriers at that point in time, and so it was a natural alliance for us. Uh, Patrick had developed the automated technology. Kalmar had a quality machine into which it could be installed. There are the obvious benefits that uh, flow from automation, uh, reducing the cost of production. But there are other significant and very important benefits. For instance, our lost time injuries in this terminal are uh, next to nothing. We've gone a year without a lost time injury. It's a very safe environment, which to Patrick is a very important outcome. Additionally, there are a whole range of ancillary savings related to infrastructure and maintenance. Our maintenance costs have reduced as a consequence of um, Machines going into an idle mode, therefore reducing the um, number of engine hours and thus the time between services or extending the time between services. The straddle carriers don't need to see at night, so as a consequence we can turn the lights off after dark in, in various parts of the terminal and save electricity. Pavement wear and tear, across a whole range of features, damage to uh, cargo, equipment and what have you, all of these metrics are positive in an automated environment. We believe that the Autostrad offers significant benefits over and above other forms of automated equipment, principally AGVs. Uh, those uh, benefits are related to the flexibility of the system. Without being disrespectful in an AGV environment, the crane driver is obliged to discharge the container onto a waiting AGV. We maintain that the coupling of the AGV to the ship-to-shore gantry crane is a potential source of weakness. A strength of our system, conversely, is the fact that the crane driver can discharge the box to the tarmac and we can build a buffer stack behind the crane. We would argue that the automated straddle carrier is far more flexible, uh, scalable and deployable than traditional AGV technology. Our customers increasingly require consistency of service. Automation delivers consistency of service, it smooths out peaks and troughs, it allows our customers to proceed with certainty in terms of their scheduling. Schedule integrity is critical to our customers' business. Automation and the consistent productivity that it brings allows us to meet our customers' needs. As, as fleets reach their um, their use by date, I think that's, that's the critical point at which people should look at automation. But look at it across a whole range of uh, areas, what it could do for completely changing the container terminal. This is not simply about moving a box from point A to point B, automation changes the whole way that the container terminal is managed.